Okay, thank you, Ahmed, and good morning to everyone. Firstly, I would like to extend my gratitude to ITU for organizing this insightful workshop on transformative connectivity through satellites. It's an honor to be, in, uh, to be here and among esteemed colleagues and uh, experts in this field and representatives of the administrations of many countries. And thanks for the question and giving, giving me this chance to talk on the very important role mm -hmm. that satellite technology plays, particularly in the realm of narrowband IoT connectivity services through satellites. And I'm representing Planet Satellite and Space Technologies company, a Turkish company, and we are a young company founded in 2021. Our mission revolves around advancing satellite technology to bridge the communication gap especially in areas where traditional terrestrial infrastructure falls short. Our focus on providing IoT connectivity services via satellites not only enhances connectivity, but also fosters innovation and progress in various sectors, from agriculture to energy or from mining to transportation. And we are aiming to empower communities and drive socioeconomic development, particularly in underserved regions. At this point, I have a short video, if we can play it. In a world where 85% of the Earth's surface remains without terrestrial networks due to geographic and economic constraints, Plan S utilizes satellite technology to bridge this connectivity gap. The essence of IoT connectivity lies in its ability to link industrial sites, ships, plants, farms, mines and various facilities in these uncovered areas where internet connectivity is essential. This cutting-edge system is optimized for massive narrowband IoT connectivity, offering unparalleled cost efficiency, exceptional reliability, low latency, and comprehensive global coverage. A distinguishing feature of the Connector IoT system is its hybrid direct-to-satellite and gateway-to-satellite connectivity. The backbone of this system is the Connector IoT satellite constellation, comprising more than 100 satellites strategically positioned to provide an unparalleled global coverage, minimal latency, and high capacity. And Planes is a new entrant in the satellite communication industry specializes in providing narrowband IoT communication services to tailor to specific needs of remote areas, particularly in developing countries and of some applications in which the cost of the connectivity is a major issue. Our services are optimized for machine-to-machine -machine and IoT communication needs to efficiently transmit small packets of data payloads multiple a day. In for the question, Connect the IoT network has the following key features. Uh, the important one is the low cost, uh, which is to make this service affordable for many applications and for many regions. Terrestrial networks may not be economically or geographically feasible for remote areas. Uh, they require expensive in infrastructure investments and it takes time to establish these infrastructure. But the satellite services do not require these costly investments and uh, this is an uh, advantage for developing countries. And we require low-cost hardware, which is a really low-cost hardware to connect any IoT device or machine to our satellite system and our service costs are really affordable for anyone ranging from very small enterprises to uh, large-scale enterprises. And the second key uh, factor or the uh, feature of our uh, IoT connectivity system is the scalability of the system. The system is scalable from very small uh, deployments like in a farm with a, a number of devices to a very large scale deployments like thousands of devices and the cost of having the service is increasing linearly uh, with the uh, number of the devices connected to our satellite network. And 
The other important aspect is the uh, our services require very low power consumption. This will enable battery operated <coughs> devices and deployments to very remote areas without <coughs> electricity. And for the use cases, uh, I will talk on a few use cases which are real and we are currently uh, making some uh, prototypes or some uh, pilot applications. One of them is precision ag agriculture uh, to increase the productivity uh, of farms by monitoring soil moisture, growth of crops, etc. And this makes the farmer to make informed decisions to increase the productivity. And uh, using this uh, IoT data through satellites, the farmer may manage irrigation, fertilization, and pest control using the sensor data uh, from their farms. And uh, this will increase the efficiency of the uh, uh, farming and definitely reduce the cost of uh, operations. And also, uh, this, is, uh, this will help the uh, control the uh, climate uh, also. And another use case is energy distribution, uh, like electricity or water meters uh, in remote areas. We are working with energy distribution companies to uh, help them to read the uh, utility devices in remote areas. Like in Turkey, uh, there is a uh, region in which there are small villages sparsely distributed and in each village there are few homes or uh, locations that uh, meters are <coughs> needs to be read and we are using our satellite connectivity systems to uh, reduce the operational cost of the uh, this process and uh, we measured that the cost of operations are reduced up to 45 percent by using satellite connectivity services and also, for, uh, we can manage or we can have the disaster uh, management systems, especially after disasters, to see, uh, to uh, manage or monitor the health of the roads, bridges, or important uh, buildings uh, to uh, support the first responders or the rescue teams uh, to uh, manage the disaster. Uh, quickly. And that's all from my side. Thank you.